Yes, sir. <laughs> now, today, we're going to talk about Rihanna, man. Rihanna, Rihanna, Rihanna. Anybody want to tell me how did this go over our head? Bruh. Look, let me tell y'all something. This is nothing more than a prime example of how they protect who it is that they want to protect and they allow you to see the things that they want you to see. Okay? So as you could tell by the beginning of this video, Rihanna has been allegedly making sacrifices all along. And this has been going on on the low, y'all. <clears throat> All right. So with that being said, let's jump into this, man, and, you know, see what this is about. Now, today, we're going to talk about Rihanna, man. Nah, Rihanna been real slick, man. She been real sly, man. I'm going to start calling her Sly Cooper, man, because the things that she been doing ain't really been it, it ain't really been getting no mainstream media attention for real man because uh it just came out that rihanna cousin just passed away at the age of 28 six years after the cousin's brother was shot dead yeah they typed it. pay attention to the numerology y'all and if you want to see the the rest of this video, man, go over to YouTube and check out, man, call me Kenfo. You know, he most definitely get it done. Yeah, very weird. You see what I'm saying? But her cousin's brother also was shot dead. Nah, I'm led to believe that Rihanna is one of the celebrities that are protected by the media. Nah, the reason why I say this is because as you can see, no major news, uh, TMZ, CNN did not cover this story. They did not cover this story. These are all third party uh, websites that's reporting about Rihanna's cousin's sudden death at the young age of 28. Now, what's interesting, if you pay attention. Which reminds me of the whole situation with the with the uh, the guy who was a. Uh allegedly a model for Balenciaga who came up missing and didn't get the, you know, I'm talking about they weren't talking about that anywhere. Anywhere. Other than social media. Uh, this video is being recorded September 4th. So these videos is from two days ago, the second, the third. So in September is when we hear about the news of Rihanna's cousin. But the interesting thing about that is Rihanna's cousin passed away back in August, man. August 13th, man. So why is we just now finding out about this? And why isn't the major media, the mass media, why are they not covering this? So I'm led to believe Rihanna is one of the celebrities that's protected by the media as well as Beyonce. Uh, when Beyonce's cousin uh, got shot by a woman named Sasha, t like Sasha Fierce, right? Which I covered that. I covered that six months ago, right? So y'all can look at that. I got that on the channel as well in the video section. But yeah, man, Rihanna's cousin passed away back in August, man. And we just not figuring out about it. Why is that, man? Let's dive in on it, man. Let's dive in. Nah, it says that Rihanna's cousin dies at 28 from big black mass in her brain. Now, it's very interesting that big black mass equals 225. When you add the letters up in the English language in reverse. Now, what's interesting about that equaling 225 is that she died from the big black mass on the 225th day of the year. Hmm, interesting. And that sounds like witchcraft in itself. Big black mass in the brain. What does that mean? What does that mean? What does she have a tumor? What does that mean? What is big black mass? What is that? What, goo? What exactly. If you know what big black mass is, man, let me know in the comment section below. Because I don't know what big black mass means at all. What do you mean by that? But come on, man. Let's get into it, man. 
Nah, it's very interesting that Rihanna and the cousin that passed away, first name Tanella, are both synchronized, right? 65 in the ordinal cipher, which is A, A equal in one, since it's the first letter of the alphabet, B equal in two, so on and so forth. I just spoke about the reverse. So if you know reverse, then you know the reduction, right? Reducing uh, the letters with double digits to single digits, reason being uh, Pythagoras, uh, believe that the true numbers were only one through nine. Double digits did not count. Double digits only get reduced, right? This is how these ciphers are being calculated. And these are the synchronicities that we see uh, with these occurrences, man. And the reason he believed that is because, you know, when it goes back to these mad theoretical gases that it takes to make up the universe, okay? So, you know, with understanding that, you know, it's only nine gases, that makes nine the highest number of mathematics, Okay. So when he says, you know, there is no number higher than that, that's why. So Tanella and Rihanna have the same synchronicity. But come on. Because uh, even if we take uh, the death day of Rihanna's cousin to her next birthday, February 20th, 2024, uh, her birthday is 191 days after the death of her sister. Just like once again, the, what we always see, society of Jesus equals 191 in the ordinal cipher. And I hope y'all notice that these are the same phrases every time, man. The same phrases. I don't never add no letters to them. I don't never take away letters. It's the same phrases, the same formula. It's the same Krabby Patty secret formula every time I do this. So it it, it it ain't no coincidence, man. But come on, let's continue. Because Rihanna's cousin passed away at the age of 28 on 28 date numerology when the word kill equals 28 in the reverse reduction cipher. Rihanna's cousin passed away on the kill date. If you pay attention to all the different ways that date numerology is calculated, uh, the prime ones is 64, 28, 44, and 17. Just like the word kill, man. Just like the word kill. And she passed away at 28. What's interesting about that number 28? Her most recent album, which obviously was a number one album. The number one album always comes before the blood sacrifice. That's why you see the blood on the cover art, right? And she's facts. I mean, just look at everybody who said that, you know, right before the album went number one, they lost somebody. The baby, uh, her husband. What is the husband name again? Somebody feel free to leave that in the comments. Hey, that Rocky? <clears throat> okay, yeah. He said that, you know, every, when, when his album goes number one, every time someone around him comes up missing mysteriously, even though he act like he didn't know, you know, that he knew what was going on. The fact of the matter is that it was taking place. So. Telling you, yeah, she's anti. Yeah, she don't fuck with nobody. She'll knock every last one of you niggas off. Right. And this album was dropped on the 28th day of the year. This is her most recent studio album up to date. And look at the synchronicity once again between anti and kill have the exact same date number, excuse me, not date numerology, but they have the same exact numerology in Gematria, man. So the clues, the clue, here's all the clues, man. Here's all the clues, and then it lead up to look at the anti, man. And then it leads up to this very day, man. Anti, yeah, she anti-social, man. She'll knock every last one of you niggas off. But come on, man. Because let's talk about the day that the studio album was released, man. This studio album was released on a day leaving 338 days remaining. Now, the interesting thing about that, uh, taking this date numerology, the date numerology is very important, right? Because all of this stuff is 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 calculated. Is the these are calculated steps. This is why these artists cannot drop whenever they want to. It's already a specific date. It's aligned with numerology. It's aligned with astrology. You see what I'm saying? But come on, because looking at the date numerology that she dropped this album, the two prime date numerologies were 65 and 38, just like Rihanna equals 65 and 38. More importantly, that number 38. 
which we know murder by numbers right with the movie uh back in around what 2002 this movie came out with the number three and the number eight telling you that murder equals 38 in gematria so rihanna is synchronized with this murder number with this death number this is why uh death is surrounding her and we're gonna talk about the rest of her sacrifices too because this ain't the only one her name equals murder okay yeah she been knocking folks off but rihanna equals 38 right rihanna equals 38 just like uh the baby that was just born uh her cousin passed away uh a few days uh 10 days after the birth of her baby her second baby that was born huh on the 3rd of august 3 slash 8 just like rihanna equals 38 so this was already signifying right spiritually that a murder was about to occur uh from the birth uh something else had to die to be born you see what i'm saying rebirth types you see what i'm saying but come on man come on because continuing the 38 man because uh rihanna and, and, and asap rocky confirm the their pregnancy with the second with the second with the second born on 38 day numerology 38 day number so this baby right here that was born on three slash eight they even announced this baby's birth on 38 day numerology so it was already hinting that a death a murder was about to occur but come on right because the death of the cousin occurred on 13 slash eight man come on man. and i want y'all to know y'all heard in the beginning i think he said it was either six months or six years prior to her passing her brother passed okay and i don't think that's a coincidence we already talking about the numerology the numbers right and look at the numbers it's, look this is crazy and come on it ain't that many coincidences in the world man but come on right let's continue man so since we know about the number 38 let's go ahead and flip that bitch right because we know we live in a dualistic world right so the duality of 38 is 83 so y'all remember when rihanna performed at the super bowl earlier this year right so it's very interesting that her cousin died on the 183rd day of her super bowl 57 appearance performance just like super bowl lvii equals 183 in the ordinal cipher order out of chaos equals 183 as well which is the 33rd degree masonic slogan so yes this was her ritual these was all her rituals this is why you see her in the red symbolizing the blood sacrifice that she was about to make we didn't even know it facts mm, mm, mm. but come on right because let's talk about the score the, the score of the super bowl because the winning team won with 38 points and guess what it was the team that was wearing red and white just like how she came out at halftime wearing red and the background dancers was wearing white man come on man even the super bowl even the super bowl was held at 4 30 on the 43rd day of the year just like rihanna equal 43 man it was down to the t man down by the numbers man down by the numbers and 38 and 43 just like rihanna killing and lucifer And even the Super Bowl 57 itself, Super Bowl 57 was held on February 12th, 2023, which is 57 date numerology, right? Super Bowl 57 was also held on a date leaving 322 days remaining. As we know, uh, Skull and Bones, right? 322. 
But the thing is, the two contenders, even adding the two contenders. And let's not forget, y'all, this is the year of Skull and Bones, okay? This, this is the year of Skull and Bones, which is why you see so many sacrifices being made at this time, okay? Well, you're going to see more because the year isn't over yet. In the Super Bowl that was on a day leaving 322 days, Kansas City Chiefs, Philadelphia Eagles, writing their names. Don't take away no letters. Don't add no extra letters. Taking it exactly how it is, man. We get 322 in the Ordinal Scythe. In the year of Skull and Bones, man. This year, next month, specifically, October 9th marks officially the 322nd anniversary of Yale University, which is home of Skull and Bones Order 322. So this is why all these rituals are occurring uh, this year. And this is why Rihanna was linked to this Skull and Bone. This is why her cousin was killed in the year of Skull and Bone. She performed. She performed at the Super Bowl on a day leaving 322 days left it was all for the ritual man it was all for the ritual but come on because even how let's see how even further how rihanna is linked to skull and bones right taking her date of birth february 20th which can be written the 20th of february or simply february 20th so we have 202 and 220 when skull and bones equals 202 uh but it's also known as the brotherhood of death when the brotherhood of death equals 220 so now we see why rihanna number got pulled yeah it's just it's just they just making a round everybody making a rounds this whole year we're gonna see for the rest of this year man it's gonna be sacrifices they gonna they gonna just gonna go around in a circle all right who you gonna give okay we can give your take your auntie okay yo yep it's time for your cousin to go yo your brother then we gonna take your uncle then your mama going yeah then your grandson everybody making their rounds man everybody giving somebody up this year man it's crazy man see you have to understand man that a lot of these people man didn't even want to be in the position that they're in some of them were chosen they were chosen to be in this position, man. All up to all by the numbers, man. They were chosen by the numbers, man. Okay. And so I don't care if it's your favorite artist or not, man. You have to understand if they're in that industry and they, you know, achieve the status that Rihanna has achieved, bro, she's done some demonic things to get there. Okay. And, you know, you don't have to believe it, man. But I tell you, man, you know, it's a lot of children, man. A lot of your children out there, you know, there's, preparing themselves to be a part of this industry, man, because they believe that everything that's being said is nothing more than a rumor, bro. And I feel like it's our responsibility to make sure if they do head this way, that they're spiritually strong enough to withstand this type of stuff, okay? To back away and say no, all right? But with that being said, man, y'all please let me know what y'all think about this in the comment section below, man. I would love to know, man. And also don't forget to go over to YouTube and follow me on YouTube at I Am Awakened. Also get over to Instagram at I, and follow me at I Am Awakened underscore chosen one okay and i just want to leave y'all as i came i want you guys to always always be aware because to be aware is to be alive and as always peace family peace meaning positive energy always creates elevation i